Hey kids, Peter Von Panda here. Uh, look what I just got. I ordered uh, some stuff from uh, uh, Hera Arms. Actually, I got it online from Land World. You can definitely check them out online. They sell a bunch of the Hera stuff. I really like their stuff. Even threw in this free pen. That's cool. Um, and uh, one of the things I got was one of the Hera Arm windowed 30 round polymer magazines for the AR-15. So these are cool. I have a few, I have a couple of these already. They're great, kind of like the P-Mag, but uh, I just like that, uh, you know, kind of straight edge to makes everything look a little futuristic and that window is pretty cool too. It kind of shows the, the, the back end of your brass. Yeah, show off that brass. But what I wanted to show you today is the multi-purpose safety selector. You've probably seen these. Um, this is what it comes uh, like. It is a, it is a safety for your AR-15 and what I did you know, I was looking to replace the standard kind of lower parts kit safety that comes with the AR, and um, I settled on this one. I looked at the Battle Arms development, the badass safety selector, but the reason I got this is uh, just the way it looked. Um, and it comes with three different colors, these plastic safety selectors in black, OD green, and flat dark earth, essentially, which is black, kind of... Oh, uh, kind of boiled green bean green and, uh, you know, kind of a dark tan. And then it comes with the safety bar itself where the two pieces will uh, attach on either end. Uh, screws that you'll screw through whatever safety selectors you attach to either end. Um, and then um, looks like kind of this fixing screw here, but I'm not sure exactly how it all goes together. So I'll find out. And it comes with a couple of Allen keys. But what I really liked is this particular safety selector. So, uh, you know, I just liked how it was skeletonized. It has some texture here on uh, the back. But, you know, when you put it on the side of your gun, it just looks cool. It's kind of flat and wide. Um, I got it because of, of looks. And then what you can do is you can pick the opposite side. So you could, it's an ambi safety. And you can take one of these and put it on... A little flip switch uh, you know a little short switch um, or you can put on nothing and just have the other side a um, you know empty but I'm gonna use it I'm gonna actually make it ambi I'm gonna use the smallest uh, switch for the the um, the right side since I'm right-handed and uh, the biggest one for my thumb here um, you know so it's pretty good value because you know if you want to switch this between guns it's you can it'd be nice if it came with a couple of these extra bars so that you could actually make use of these switches that you don't use but i'm going to go ahead and install this i'm not going to show you that process because um that uh there are lots of videos on how to do that online uh but i will show you the final the final uh look of the gun when i get it on pretty pretty modest change and you know safety selectors unfortunately um while they can improve the ergos, you know, you get a little more um, uh, real estate to flip the switch or whatever. You know, they're pretty small and subtle change. And I want to say this safety selector switch was 45 bucks, So they're not giving them away, but, you know, it's another way to kind of just add a little personal touch. So we'll, we'll put it on. What's up, dude? So I went ahead and installed the safety selector. I actually figured out why there are uh, three different screws. There's actually two short screws. So if you use kind of these thin, flat... Um, uh, switches on either side then you use the short screw for these but then if you use one of the the thicker one like I did here you're going to use that longer uh the longer screw so here's the fi fi finished product and I love it you know it sticks out uh, you know a nice uh long way here so you know when I'm uh manipulating with my thumb broom no problem lots of uh grippy area there and uh you know it's just good texture and just sticks out like like crazy but i love that flat skeletonized look you know it just kind of gives the the gun even more kind of a uh a futuristic modern custom feel pretty minor but I, I dig it and on the other side i used just the uh a short uh this kind of flat uh, switch here so you know it works well so now you, i have a truly ambi safety um you know, when you're putting this in, don't forget to take out the detent. Be careful with the spring here. Um, you know, nice positive clicks. And uh, this polymer that they're using seems like it should, 
it should uh, stand up well, but only time will tell that. Um, you know, so I just did, definitely dig one. This is the this is the AR that I that I kind of put my love and money into. Um, if you want to see it, I've never done a video on it. Maybe I'll show that to you sometime. But uh, otherwise, I really like this uh, Hair Arms multi-purpose safety selector. I think it's the the coolest one I've found. Peter Von Panda out.